YouTube, it's Middleborough back with uh, day 26 of the Resol 300. Oh, got someone dropping by, quite literally. I'm gonna start off here. See you later. But, uh, as Z, I've been doing a little bit of digging overnight. Like, I didn't get to it as early as I wanted to overnight, but, um, basically, I kind of I dug the trench out a couple blocks, like, I think three blocks below. So I need to dig it out three more blocks, like, you know, to, uh, be happy with what I want. This is only one side of the trench that I want to do. But I figured you'll kind of leave it there for overnight, and, like, my spring leg is actually healing up. I forgot to splint it, but we're back. I've been working on the motorcycle overnight. Like, uh, I left it, left the frame crafting. I had to make some more glue and duct tape. So, got a big mama here. Let me just kind of get this food and ate up for for once, and come here, big mama. Ow. Punching me. I actually have enough steel for a motorcycle. It's like I still have to work on more for the others, but hopefully I don't get lost to the world because of a game crash, but of course a zombie bear. Take you take you on really quickly. Should be able to unlock some tier five jobs this time, so uh the only thing is like uh won't be unlocked from Joel for today, but reading these knife books. Bone knife quality three. Six more books. Okay, you don't need to spit. Be quiet, yo. And so, a couple little uh, books. Six more books from a cement mixer. Uh, so, let's go check. I know I had to make a bunch of like I had to take take the bones and make a bunch of glue from the um from the old work uh you know like uh because I'm running low. Oh look, little campsite zombies. See you later. Ready a big mama. Come here. I know you wanna get punched. There you go. Oh her her sister's there. Come here. Did I take you down? No, unfortunately not. There you go. While we're here, we might as well just grab this, uh, grab all this cloth. This is actually not too bad of a spot, like if you see these out in the wild, to grab them. Ah, I got some collapse on it, but... Oh well. Nice little 53 cloth out of that. Oh. Gotta be careful here because the mini bike's on its last leg, but shouldn't have to worry about the mini bike for much longer, at least for me. This ought to be fun. Nope, dog. I'll just keep riding. Not gonna stop for every little zombie, but oh, I think the chassis's at least ready enough. So, all right. Let's check to see. Ah, great. Mini bikes, uh, mini bikes are flaming. Hang on, I don't want to potentially go kaboom and suddenly I'm, I'm looking dumb. Let's see, mini bike. Here. Just have a, just have a repair kit, just so you don't get mad at me. So, yeah, just dump some stuff off in here really quick, some stone stuff in the stone box, and we can just drop some 44s in the 44 Magnum chest, and shoddy, we got building up a good amount of 762s, so motorcycle chassis is ready. All the glue is ready as well. Wonderful to see. And start making more. 
Oh, so much cloth to use for that thing. I mean, I'm gonna I'm gonna need all that cloth because of because of the sheer amount of um. What am I trying to say? The sheer amount of duct tape I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need like 45 total. So you're already done. Get you on the craft. And before I forget about making more steel, we'll just make work on you. So. I have the resources for a secondary motorcycle handlebars and throw the legendary parts back in to the box. We'll just throw most of that in there. You see I have machine gun parts on me because I did decide to take decision of making a tier 6 M60 which is 11 minutes to make. I should get my wheels on me and throw that back in there. Have enough duct tape to make another to make another um motorcycle chassis if I get all the steel. So we'll be waiting on that for a second, but figured can do a little bit of farm upgrade stuff to help out a little bit. So just gonna grab some seeds. And been waiting to stock, take care of these because I got 62 farm plots to put down. I'd say we're doing pretty good on the series so far, like, you know, kind of for the purpose of it. Um, one second while I spent a couple skill points since I thought of that. Um, yeah, we'll do pain tolerance there. And I have no chance to get stunned now. Lovely. This is why I've been kind of waiting to... Why I hesitated on planting yesterday, because... I think because I'm like, oh, I'm going to make some farm upgrades to the old, um... You know, upgrades to the old farm, so I'm like, wouldn't be a bad idea just to... Kind of just hold off on crop reduction. I was going to check player levels, though. Level 85, so considering we need we need to get to level 300, we're kind of creeping up on a third of our progress. So probably going to be a decent little section of farm plots here. So one second while I kind of get this dug out a little bit, and we'll kind of come back once I'm playing the seeds. So catch you in a moment. Alrighty, so I've got all the farm plots placed down and kind of ready to start planting. So what I'm going to do here is uh, I've converted most of the cotton I've harvested over the journey to seeds so I can kind of start farming cloth up. It's a good idea just to have that farmed up just in case, you know, it's like, because uh, it is a one-to-one -one conversion rate on on cloth, so planting super corn. It's going to be kind of mostly a a random sort. You know, not going to be the most organized thing in the world. It's just you know, like you just kind of want to get things going. Going like probably going to expand the farm plot over some more. And there's our corn and. Where I already took care of the cotton plants, so we're just gonna plant our chrysanthemums and there you go. I think we might actually have enough room for everything to to grow. I'm hoping so at least. And grab that and hop seed. Looks like we won't have enough room for 
for the yucca, but like I say, we can expand this all out. So nice having a little bit, have a little bit more. I could have had the farm rabbit on the whole time mushrooms. I done it. Yeah, mushrooms, because I think I need those for herbal antibiotics. I just realized I had a farmer outfit. I could have, I could have made that so much more. Ah well, no one's perfect. Sometimes, uh, sometimes just forget. Throw you in and there. I organized my inventory without thinking I really wanted to. Check on our first set of so there's two handlebars do you've been working away at the old iron so um are you serious I had a whole stack of iron sitting in the sitting in the forge oh how lovely we're just gonna refuel this just so I have plenty for plenty of smell time in it. Forty minutes sounds good to me. And we'll just kind of throw this in for that stuff. But finally, we can I can make a motorcycle. We have we have some spare batteries. We're kind of going into high quality ones though, which I rather not. But I'll at least use the tier three. That means I should probably go salting for some batteries along the way. So um, I thought I had some enforcer gloves. I think it was no. Uh, there was some gloves I had that that I kind of wanted to use for that specific purpose. Not radiated damage. No. I could have sworn there was a specific armor set. Scavenger gloves. That's what I wanted to use. So we'll swap that out for for that, and I'll throw that in there with the duct tape and the wood, and then we'll throw the steel back in its metal box. But let's get this motorcycle worked on. Um. Two minutes and thirty seconds. And while we're thinking of that, might as well go. Might as well pull the pull my supercharger mod out of the out of the mini bike and the fuel saver, the fuel reserve. Speaking of fuel saver, we have nine balls of acid, but I want to save those for chemistry stations. I can make fuel fuel savers, but let me check. It's it would be vehicle fuel saver. Four bottles of acid and some mechanical parts. I might make two chemistry stations. That's why I'm kind of like, I uh, don't know if I really want to make it. So, I almost forgot since I have the SMG on me, we're going to swap the stack of ammo out for 762 out for some 9mm ammunition. That'll work, and oh, it's a good thing I'm. I've decided to pull some stuff out of the. Pull a couple mods out of that. Was there another weapon I want? Another mod I wanted to use though. Um, it's either Red Dot or the Hunter. I think I'll just take the Hunter mod, so. Because we already got a muzzle break. There we go. Drum magazine and and full and full auto for faster fire rate. The hunter's just a good all around damage modification, so. How are you looking on that motorcycle? 45 seconds. So yeah, I'm going to go over and tr turn that uh tier four job into Joel. We'll see what our reward is for tier five. So I will catch you guys uh, in just a moment. I might do some salvaging over there.
Well, everybody, I'm coming up on Trader Joel's. I'm cack ups, you know, side cut and sadder than usual, but I have gone scrapping a little bit on the way over. I got the supercharger and, like, I've got the fuel tank reserve mod on mods on motorcycle. And it's like, this thing is so speedy now. The only thing I'm missing for it is a. Is a, is a piece of die, so it's a really big thing. I managed to salvage up like four more engines, which would be good for a generator bank. I did get another vehicle's buck. Let's wear my old biker gloves again. And we're 47 out of 100, I believe we are. Just don't mind me throwing some stuff in, but we need like 75, I believe it is, for unlock a 4x4, four four, you know, like, unlock crafting recipe for it. But, let's see what old Trader Jolly Boy has for me. What you, you got? Again. Here you go. If you spend it all in one place, make sure it's at 25 Trader more forged steel, I will take that. And we got... I, I was already expecting it, but... Battery bank bundle. Melee mods bundle, or... I'll take battery bank. Hard to turn that down. And keep in mind, like I said yesterday, like cool. Like I said earlier, we're not gonna be in the tier five jaws, but Have we a can good stream. Thank you, Drago. We always need someone to handle the We're gonna take job. on COC chemicals for that the infestation. Is fantastic news. Our armor is known throughout the land. Of course, just make sure we can check. Well, they're smart, and... then there's dead. <laughs> I guess we know which one you are. Yeah, I'm the one who stays alive. So, let me check my current life here. Keep in mind, like, this is something I've been, I'm trying to do, like, uh, so I basically survived for five days, like, in kind of up in two minutes. The days are set to one hour long, and, uh, but... The reason why I'm trying to stay alive for so long, well, it's like, you should try to stay alive for so long, always in the game, but I want to do it because, I want to do this because it's like, I'm trying to go, oh, wow, tier 5 sniper rifle. Go away. Take care of you. There we go. Is um... Because I'm, because this is also kind of serving as a platinum trophy run. That's why I'm doing this whole series, the race level 300. So, harvest car parts complete for a challenge. Oh wow, tier six slug car battery. And if you remember me kind of saying some stuff around like yo, you know, like how I can't find tier sixes. I think that only a like with the latest update for the game. I believe they say that because it's like, it applies to tools and weapons, like you can't find those anymore out of like infestations and all that. So, we're gonna just stop here really quickly. Oh, hello little lady. See you later. Um, just to try and salvage up a couple more batteries, it's like, that is kind of surprising though, just seeing a tier 6 battery come out of a car. Then again, like, kind of almost like, I don't know if it would make sense like, coming from a police car, but... Hmm. So. Especially since we got a battery bank bundle now, it's like, just a good idea to kind of start really salvaging up uh, extra... Try salvaging up extra car batteries, like, you know, can always use them for more vehicles. See if we get another one out of this one. No, sadly not, but at least I'm getting a good amount of gas and stuff out of these vehicles. It doesn't take you long with the uh, impact driver being fully mod out. Whew. Hey, I also forgot that I had the uh, the chance to harvest acid from the from the Wasteland Treasures books, so so I can also get additional acid. Speaking of which. Thank you, game, for being so generous to me. Looks like we got another little friendo over here. There you go. Take care of you. And... 
Let's see. Let's search, let's search you, and let's salvage you. I think these kind of give out the same amount of extra little bits, like, you know, they don't really have an advantage, just they're more tanky. But, unfortunately, no more battery out of that. Only got the one battery from the, from the, uh, from the cop car. So yeah, I'll meet you over at the, at the job, folks, and we'll do that quick. Battery! Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Big tubs go away from Smack you. And... Oh, hey, Neil Armstrong. We'll throw... I actually need to repair my knuckles. Yeah, we'll get over there. Alrighty, everybody, so... Okay, we're, we're actually kind of coming over and raiding this place again. So, one thing, I kinda, one thing that happened off-camera was, uh... I actually managed to get the... The Neil Armstrong trophy, finally. So, uh, that's actually a good thing. Because I've been waiting for that trophy for a while. I'll kind of let it play for you right now. Oh, hey, Neil Armstrong. And so, uh, the... The reason... Uh, like, why that's kind of a big trophy pop is... Because, um, that's travel a thousand kilometers in the game, and... That is a... That's been a trophy, I believe, Vegas has been waiting on, like... He kind of stopped playing seven days for a bit, if you know him from my co-op series, like, you know, because he's kind of got a little bored of it, so. But it's just kind of what it was like, I just got that trophy, I finally, you know, like, traveled like a thousand kilometers in the game, like, we're up to 49 books for that, so. Kind of what it was a big, kind of find that funny that I'm waiting for the trophy to pop and everything like that, and Trex respawned. And just, just kind of hilarious. Right, this is the... This is the place that was, um... This is that place I was waiting for... I was waiting for, or like I found that I could harvest acid out of the barrels. Uh, let me drink a beer real quick, just to... Just to help myself out with the damage. Come here. Yeah. There we go, take care of that big guy there. And we'll worry about, I'll worry about the barrels uh, just for, in a little moment, so. I want to try to maximize this beer. Come here, guys. All radios, please come over. Take you. Come here. And <laughs> these guys are basically behaving like bouncy balls now. Um, anybody else? That was someone I already took down. Anybody? Let's check the clothes pile. Because you never know, you might find a legendary part out of those. Our parts are still good. Hello? Come here. I got, I got punchy punchy for everybody. Take care of you. And see you later. 
I don't appreciate you not trying to dodge me. I know kind of going kind of gung ho, but I'm like the beer kind of gives you a little bit of confidence when you're brawling like me. So I keep forgetting to make steel knuckles, but birdie. See, like, I just punched him back over to where he was. Um, all right. Not a big deal that I'm even falling over. Just means I get to run over here again. Woo! And don't fall off again, though. Would appreciate myself not doing that. Thank you very much. I think we're supposed... No, that's where we entered. Yeah, we're supposed to drop in through here and... Come here. Oh, thank you for the loot back. Eh, don't need the, don't need the books, but... Punch your way through the door. And... Come run up here, that's kind of cool. Anybody, 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 I would like to have a word. Take you. See you later. And I'm supposed to jump up here. There's a little ammo pile here for for your view and pleasure. Hello. Alright guys, let's make this a little bit quick. Because I'm running a little low on the old beer buzz. Come here. These guys just fall through. I might have to increase the difficulty soon. Maybe if we make it through the Horde Knight, uh, yo, don't get taken down, we'll be fine. Uh, yo, just an increased difficulty. Infested job clear, though. Um, usually I'd be really gung-ho about the loot stash, but let's kind of... I'm going to fast-forward through this food real quick and see how much acid we get out of these barrels. So, <laughs> be back in a second. Alrighty, everybody, so, um, I've kind of gone through, uh, I think I've gone through most of the two main sections where I know where there's gas barrels, uh, like old the ass barrels, they call them. Grab you really quick, and I've grabbed and, you know, hit them, and only two acid, but hey, I'm not going to complain about getting, you know, potentially getting some acid out of the, out of this area, so, but... We're gonna break it to the loo, it's, it's not gonna take that long. I'm like, I'm just gonna leave a cut in for you, so. Yeah. It's one of those, it's like, I'm like, hey, I, I don't mind doing this if it means I can respawn for potential acid chance out of the barrels. See, we're already almost broke through this um, reinforced chest, so. Kind of break through the boxes too while we're at it. And since we're since we got the infested cash, I'm going to break it down. Like how you do it is basically we're gonna just leave stuff in the infestation cache and then just turn that in there and and grab that in our vehicle book. That yeah, gives you a little bit of steel. I should have put my gloves on for it, but that's okay. Tier 4 stun baton, I think Krim has a tier 5, but I'm gonna read through all these. Better at volume 7, I think Zin needs that, so nothing from shotguns, but robotic sludge, quality 3 I can make, got more of that stuff, the vitamins, burning shaft mod I can take. I'm just going to read those quick and grab that. Oh, split. Lovely. I'm like, what's taking up my inventory? And we're probably gonna just bolt right over to bolt right over to the to the trader because we're full up on loot. So it's not that far off, but it should be a fun little reward, yo. Kind of like as a part of the award from Trader Joel. Let me not spin out though. I keep forgetting about a die from from uh, yo know, some of the color of the motorcycle from from Trader Joel. So we'll kind of look at that here in a second. I love the sense of speed on this thing though. 
And of course I gotta do my wheelies. Gotta love them. Stove kind of calls me evil can you what you want to be. He's one of my um, uh, regular viewers uh, across YouTube and Twitch. It's like, and I will not deny that. Just slide to there and we can now move up to Terra Joel. Oh, Joel, I'm back. What do you have for me? Just, wow, hello again. Mm, what can we get you? I'm gonna take the antibiotics just to have extra stock of that. And I'm not gonna take any more jobs from me. Raider Joel's is your one-stop shop for all things your, armor. Your dies, cause buy that off you. I'm just gonna toss the clay and stone. Two X scope mod didn't even notice that. But I'm gonna buy a couple dies off you just to just so everybody can have a little bit of a color in their life. Purple, um, brown. I don't know. If people want that. Mm, can Remember, I make a ergo grip? If you need armor. Let me see here. Can I make ergo grips? No, I cannot. See if he has a if schematic fast, for it, because that's worth more to stick. me. Um, No, he does not. I'll buy those, though, off you. And that's pretty much all what he has, so... Oh, thank you. Uh, I needed a sale after dealing with gawkers and talkers all day. Yeah. Now I'm kind of probably, this might be a little bit of a short episode because of it, but I'm going to call this episode here because I do want to do some more work on the Horde base overnight and try and get stuff taken care of. So if you made this far into the episode and like what you see, uh, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below. It helps the channel oh so much. I hope you have a good one and take care.